So, for example, we have a thousand trillionaires in America. I mean, billionaires in America. And what's happening? They're in a situation where they, in fact, pay 8.2 percent in taxes. If they just paid 24 percent. 25 percent, either one of those numbers. They've raised $500 million, billion dollars, I should say, in a 10-year period. We'd be able to right wipe out his debt. We'd be able to help make sure that all those things we need to do, child care, elder care, making sure that we continue to strengthen our health care system, making sure that we're able to make every single solitary person eligible for what I've been able to do with the, uh, with, with, with the COVID, excuse me, with the um, Mm. Dealing with everything we have to do with, uh, look, if oh. we finally beat Medicare. Thank you, President uh, Biden. President Trump? Well, he's right. He did beat Medicare. He beat it to death, and he's destroying Medicare. Oh, my God. That's so cringe, dude. What the fuck? I, uh, eligible for what I've been able to do with the, uh, with, with, with the COVID, excuse me, with um, dealing with everything we have to do with, uh, look, if we finally beat Medicare. Thank you, President uh, Biden. President Trump? Well, he's right. He did beat Medicare. He beat it to death, and he's destroying Medicare. Oh, my God, dude. He's old. Yeah, I mean, he is old. There should be a max age limit for presidents. Like, it, they really should be, right? I mean, what the fuck is that? All politicians are old? Yeah, but not ancient, right? I get it. It takes a long time to go from starting politics to, to being the president of US of A, right? But, I mean, come on literally dementia like unironically dementia that can't be right who would vote for this again <laughs> <laughs>